Coach McCreary again. Thanks again for stopping by. Today's tip is for pitchers and how to set their feet from the stretch position when they come set. Now, a lot of young kids will make the very basic mistake is that when they come set, they will put their feet right next to each other. Now, there is no sport on earth where an athlete is going to have quickness, power, and balance when their feet are close together. The athletic position, if you want to have all those things, involves keeping your feet apart. A little bit about shoulder width. But when you're on a mound, of course, if you have to worry about runners stealing and so forth, it's not very practical to come set with your feet totally in an athletic position because it's going to take you a long time to bring that knee up and then get around and make your pitch. And of course, the longer it takes you to do that, the more likely a guy is going to steal. But a pitcher does want to have some space in between their feet when they come set. It's going to help with balance, it's going to help with quickness, and if there should be a runner take off early or you have to do a pickoff move, that balance and power and quickness is going to come into play. Also, when, when pitchers get older, and especially right-handed pitchers, when you are working on pickoffs to first base, to properly do a pickoff to first base, you're going to need space in between your feet so that you turn your foot and then you're able to make that throw. Of course, you can't do that with that foot if your feet are right next to each other. You're going to have to do it a different way. So as you get older, it becomes more important with pickoff moves to first base, but generally speaking, a pitcher is always going to be in a better balanced and powerful position when there is a little bit of space in between your feet. So there's your tip for the day, folks. Thanks again for stopping by, and pitchers get out there, and when you come set, make sure you have some space in between those feet. Well, I'm Coach McCurry. Thanks again for stopping by, everybody, and have a great day.